Sunday is the day that women either feel good or guilty. Why would they feel good? Because they just got some ham bone from their husband or their boyfriend. Hopefully their husband. So they feel good, you know. Um, so they feeling good. They had a good weekend. They then went on some dates with the man they love or like. And, you know, he gave it to them good, long stroke. Yinkum, yinkum, yinkum. So he like, yeah. So that's what's going on, man. That's what's going on. Why would they feel guilty? Because they gave their body to a man that don't love them. So they either going to feel guilty or good. They gave their body to a man that they didn't deserve it. They claimed they're going to blame it on an out, 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 out at home. But they did it. They wanted to do it anyway. The alcohol could have had a little bit of influence in it. But you got to be careful out here, man. You got to be careful out here because a lot of these women get mad at you because they gave their body to the wrong man. So when you meet them, they getting smart with you, attitude with you, and you ain't done nothing. You just like, hey, how you doing? What's up? You know, is she attractive? This and that. You don't know she just got finished slipping on a ham bone, got still got residue, ham bone residue all around her mouth. You don't know that. You thought she just had you you thought she just ate a glazed donut. You ain't know she just was slipping on a ham bone. You know what I'm saying? You ain't know. So she catching an attitude with you. Because in her mind, you are the one who did it. She don't want to confess or confront or she probably can't even talk to the guy. He probably cut her off or blocked her after she sucked the ham bone. So now, every guy look the same. All of a sudden, every guy, she see that dude's face. But some of them don't care. Some of them feel guilty even though that's what they wanted to do. A lot of these women, they don't have a lot, they don't have God in them. A lot of them don't have God in them, man. So this is what you, this is what happens when you don't have a godless, you have a godless society and women who don't pray, who ain't connected with God, ain't nobody perfect. None of us perfect. But when you don't have, you have a society where women, when they, when they not prayed up like they supposed to, this is what happens. This is what happens. So, stay prayed up, man. Stay prayed up because they going hard out here, bro. She getting mad at you. She got an attitude because she feel guilty. Because she's been giving her body to guys that don't deserve it. So now she want to take it out on you? That's not cool, man. Don't entertain those type of women, man. They got demons in them. They got dark spirits. They got malevolent spirits up in them. You got to avoid women and men. Everybody, family members, whoever got malevolent spirits in them. And if you got them in you, you got to go pray them out. Read the Bible. Pray. Ask God to help you get them out. He'll get them. He'll help you get them out. Words are powerful. God can hear you better than I can hear you. If Siri can hear you, of course you know God can hear you. Technology ain't more powerful than God. All you got to do is talk. All you have to do is talk. God can hear you, man. I'm Alan Ray in there. Follow me on Instagram at Alan Ray in there. Show on Instagram. We can do a consultation. Or you can get my latest health and relationship products and techniques. All right? On Instagram, my latest product now is our cold product. It's a food that you it make it real hard for you to get sick. It make it real hard for you to get a full-blown cold and stuff on you. If you want to know that food... $20 donation, message me on Instagram. If you want to know the remedy I've used, even though I was already all right, that made my hand bone, my Willy Wonka, my Wee Wee get two inches longer, two inches thicker. Hundreds of guys already been using it from me. Uh, they already found out the three foods I've been eating and it's working for them. If you think it can work for you in some form, message me, $20 donation to my Instagram at Allery in there. Um, show. Yeah. Link is in the description box and, uh, you can get down and get down with the process. Um, hit like, subscribe, hit the bell. Um, feel so you can be notified for the next video. 
Also, share, feel free to share my videos on your Facebook, TikTok, and Instagram. I'll holler at y'all later, man. I'm out. Stay prayed up in Jesus' name. We rebuke Satan in the name of Jesus. It's not about perfection. It's about connection. We out. Stay prayed up in Jesus' name. Peace.